What is up guys, BKRTV and in today's video we're going to be looking at how to create custom championship logos. Now, these are for WW2K17, it's just a way to create your own championship and not have to rely on the relief or the in-game logos that they provide. So, first things first, you want to make a template shape of the plate that you want to use on your championship. In my case, I have one preloaded the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. Now to do this, I there was two ways I did this. I was either screenshotting the plate from the game and tracing around that plate, or I went on Google Images, got an image of the WWE Championship and traced that, made the shape, and that's our template to work with. Now, next thing I do is I don't like usually using jet black for detail because it just doesn't quite look right. So I will go on Google and just get a um, carbon fiber texture, put that in, then drop it to about 40% opacity. So it's, as you can see, it's got the detail, but it's nice and dark. So now we've got the template or area we're working in, we can now create shapes or add shapes and text to this to create our detail. So let's go with just let's go with some uh, text first. Let's go champion. This can be whatever font you want. It just happened to be the first font I came across, which happens to be the uh, current raw font. And then what you do is if you go, if you drag it into curve, so you mask it into the shape and set it to erase, it'll then erase it. So that's an area there that will become gold in game. Let's add some more shapes, as well as text, I also have some uh, dingbat fonts. So let's just say, uh, let's add that. I can't quite see what it is yet, but as soon as I erase it, you'll, you'll, read it. you'll <laughs> see what it is. So put it in there, set that to erase, we've got ourselves another thing. I'm going to copy and paste that, put that one up top as well, just some form of symmetry. And I don't know, let's just put a triangle, flip a triangle put that in the center got something there as well and you don't have to do this normal shapes you can make your own with the pen tool so if you go to a pen tool make some sporadic uh, nodes curve the lines and you got yourself another shape for your championship so essentially you're just making loads of detailed shapes setting them to arrays and then arranging them across your championship. I'm going to just put one more and I'm going to find my skull font wherever it is. I should tell you what, I'll go for a globe just for quickness. So we'll take the globe, make it large, put it there, set that to arrays. I will just do one more thing with the pen tool just to make this area not so dark or less carbon fiber, more gold. Copy and paste, put that over there. There we go. Erase them as well. There we go. We have ourselves a championship design. It's pretty basic. Now to get the effect. 3D effect, if you click on the curve, go to bevel and emboss, set it to emboss, put the radius to 1, depth anywhere between 5 and 10, I'm just going to go 5 for now, and then just, I don't know, just have it perfectly vertical, there we go. Now this effect, if I click off, will, it's 3D but it looks like it's sticking out from the design. So it's almost like you're having something put on top of the plate, which is fine if that's what you want. Also, but instead, if you click on invert, it will obviously invert the bevel. But if you look, it looks like it's sunk in. So this is how you create the effect of having an engraved detail on your championship, which I just found about the other day. So we have this championship, it's got what looks like the carbon fiber is engraved 
into the design. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go on to 2K now. I'm going to put this in. And I'm going to show you guys how to apply it once you're in the game. Okay, so I'm now in 2K. I have the, the WWE Championship in Creator Championship. As you can see, it's got the normal plates, no detail. So what I usually do is if I go to Relief, I'll go look in the front plates. I'll look for any plate that's essentially nice and smooth usually my go-to plate is the WCW plate this one what I'll do is I will make it full stretch because I want that gold bit at the bottom to completely cover the plate try and get that red text out of the way so I just keep stretching until it does this is probably the longest part of the process but once it's done you have a completely covered plate with a bit of gold texture on so we go to custom logos find my logo that I just made a second ago stretch it out how you want and there we go as you can see it is I'm just gonna make it a little smaller on the sides there we go as you can see there we go we have a championship it looks engraved and it looks really nice so I'm just going to save that back out a bit and as you can see even far away it looks really good so that is how you make custom championship logos on 2k using affinity designer it also works with Photoshop any kind of photo and graphic program Anyway, that's been BKRTPV. Please like, favorite, subscribe for more tutorials. I will catch you on the next one, and peace.